Hello everyone, welcome to another AI video where I will show you another tool where you can create AI images like this and also you can create images to video like this and this tool is totally free by Google and you can also create consistent character videos like this as you can see this is a robot walking and this is the same style with the consistent reference so watch this video till the end and learn how to use it so the AI tool which can create awesome images like this is called Whisk AI. So the tool is now on experiment mode. You can come to this website. I'll give the link in the description box. But first, if you go to this website, it will tell you that Whisk is not available in your country yet. So for that, you can use a VPN. I am using a VPN which is called Urban VPN Proxy Extension in Chrome browser. So after that, you just need to log in into Google account and click on enter tool and it will take you to this interface so let me give you a quick overview of the, all the settings here here you just need to type your brand what you want for your image and here is the quick dice roll it will give you an example prompt or idea what you want to make so we just click it and as you can see these are giving me random prompt from my images and this is the aspect ratio they have only three aspect ratio which is square portrait and landscape and this is the model here they have quality and best quality and we're going to use the best quality and in the left corner here you have the menu you can select a preset where you can use the style what type of style you want to create on your images but right now i'm just going to use the default and here's the option you can add images to create your own consistent character scene but first i'm just going to create a example images to show you how cool this is so I'm just going to use this prompt, a macro photograph of a colorful tiny gome riding a snail to a three green forest magical fantasy. So I'm just going to choose the 16 by 9 ratio and click submit. Now here is my photo which is look pretty cool. This is the number one and this is the number two. Now you can also go to the refine option, click on this refine. And here you can create another photo with the reference of this photo. The, sn the snail is on a dance forehead with a magical hat and click submit. Now it give me another picture, the snail is on a dense forest with a magical hat. As you can see it's changed the gnome here. So this is the refine option where you can create, get the reference image and create another image. So the cool trick is here, you can click on add images and this will give you three options, subject, scene and style. Now here you can upload an image of a subject. I'm going to upload this cool summary picture into the subject and this is now my subject here as you can see now i'm going to add a scene like a what kind of background scene you want on your picture i'm going to add this ghibli style scene for the background just drag and drop the image and for the style i'm going to also add a ghibli image so this is the style of a ghibli image i just downloaded it from internet now after all the three style a subject scene and style i'm going to tell to create an image so I just give a simple prompt, a samurai resting under the tree in a peaceful village. Let's choose the aspect ratio as 16 by 9 and create. So look at these two pictures, how cool is this? And also they give me the prompt of this image. So this is the exact samurai and the exact style that I want. And this is also cool. So this was the samurai that I uploaded. This was the scene and this is the style that I want. Like a Studio Ghibli anime. So I like both of them. I like this one. You can also create another picture from this prompt. So if I click generate, it will give me the same images but with a different tone I guess. As you can see with the different side. So now if I go to the refine option because I have all the subject and style and scene. Click on refine. So I just give a simple prompt, the samurai is holding a cat and click submit. Now as you can see, it gave me the cat, the samurai is really holding a cat, but the cat is also look like a demon here, you can see. So if I just give the prompt with the specific details about the cat, maybe this will also change the image of the cat here. Okay, so you just learned to add a subject, add a scene and also a style to create. What kind of a style do you want your image and also the subject? Now I'm going to create another scene with another subject with another style. You can also add multiple objects in this scene and style. So if I just upload another subject here or you can also enter text to your subject. So I'm going to just create another image from this website. So I just put a simple prompt, a rusty robot, click generate and this give me a rusty robot as you can see. And I want these two images in the same scene where I can also add scene 
with enter text or upload images so if i just click on enter text and create another images with the from the website again i put a simple prompt a village with stone road click generate and it give me this image which is kind of realistic and for the style i'm going to delete this style and add a new one this time i want the style to be pixar movie style click generate and as you can see this is really looking like a pixar movie style so i'm going to delete the ghibli style here and i want these images to be now on pixar style now i have to give the details here right now i have to give a new prompt here so i just give a simple prompt the robot and samurai having meal together in the village which i want in pixar style with this type of background and these are my subjects so if i just choose the aspect ratio 16 by 9 and click generate i can see it create me two images which looking pretty good a rusty robot and the samurai take give eating a meal in the cobblestone road in a village and also these images look perfect which added a table here and this is the perfect images that i want and also it gives me the prompts here and also you can create videos with this ai so if i go to my videos tab no videos here yet because because i didn't create any video with my id here but i'm going to show you how to create videos with this but if you're a free user you will get only 10 generation for month so to create a video here you can see there's the animate option click on animate and this will give you this another page and i have 50 generation because i have a pro subscription if you already have a pro subscription you will get 50 or 100 or or 100 generation because in another id i got 100 generation i don't know why so if i just give it a prompt here like they're eating a meal here so just give a simple prompt the robot and the samurai eating meal and click generate and after one minute it give me this video if i play this now as you can see the samurai is eating a meal and the robot is chatting about something here i don't know but this is a very cool feature right now and this is the experimental option and you can create your video with images like i created these two video with this image this is the scene and this was the style and i just give the prompt the robot is walking and then i just give a prompt the robot is petting a dog so this way you can create your videos with consistent characters which is a pretty useful tool and right now i'm going to show you another feature here so if i just so if i just go to this left here and click on new project and if i click on this again here you can find a select a preset option we can choose this preset option to create your images like sticker you will get sticker type images so if i go to the dice click again and create my images and i like this prompt miniature toy transit toy building city in a simple flood and as you can see my preset was a sticker and this will give me a sticker style image so you can see these are the two images that give me which is the presets that i choose are like sticker style so if i choose another now i'm going to choose capsule toy which will i think which i think will look pretty cool with this prompt here so if i just click on capsule toy and this is the image they give me i think i like this one which is pretty cool and these are the actual images by the prompt and this is the plushy style as you can see i selected the plushy style effect this is the animal penis style which is also looking good and last here i want to show you another cool trick that you can use from the home page because if you go to the home page you can see there's a lot of images that you can like and if you want a style that you want your image like i like this comic book style here so if i just click on it and you can see there's an option of make your own so if i click make your own now i get the whole prompt here now i can modify the prompt here to create the same image style with my own character so i just change the character into a robot again and click enter and as you can see i get the same image style with the robot here and you can modify the prompt here to get your own style that you want from the home page that i show you so that's it guys this is what i want to show you this is totally free right now and with the video animation you will get 10 generate per day and i don't know how many images you can create with this tool because i've been creating a lot and it doesn't give me any limitation right now so that's it guys if you found this video helpful i always come up with the latest ai tech and ai tech, AI tech tutorial videos so, if, so please subscribe to stay tuned for more